Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Captain Chang Plays A Spec vs. Assault. This is a game by a pretty much a one man development team, uh, Dan I.B. Woods. He did a game where I did not give him a very good rating because it's basically a Wing Commander clone and with not much uh, chrome and polish and kind of inexcusable like uh, 20 some years after the game came out. Looks like uh, a spec is kind of a derivative of that and at this time where you're simulating uh, like a gunboat, gunship, corvette, whatever you want to call it. Uh, more advanced craft, more weapons, but uh, less fighter-like, more lumbering. Uh, well, we'll see how it works. Lufus, uh, this is the first time I've ever played it, so we'll see how that works. Okay, so I guess we could little... And this is just a quick reminder for you to please subscribe to this channel, like this video, share this video, or perhaps comment on this video and perhaps to shape the future of this uh, channel. Okay, you can see that this is very much uh, just like the uh, the Curson Corvette Four thousand tons Field armor and hull Two gun ports, one launcher ports Five turret mounts Three passive support modules. Let's check out the loadout. Okay, uh, you can almost see that this is definitely a very uh, kind of a Western thing. I mean, the it kind of shows that the native is uh, these uh, terms are kind of translated uh, instead of artillery I probably would have used cannon and then uh, AP cost is 2 billion uh, let's see 2.1 billion, and then uh, this uh, medium blaster is also 2.1 billion, and there is no launcher because uh, apparently there's none in the game at the moment, no missiles, uh, but the turrets uh, definitely have a triple blast and they cover different shield arcs, which is nice. Auto cannons. Two auto cannons can engage different targets. Uh, two heavy cannons for the front. Shield booster, engine optimizer. Light increase in the. And then there is a gun booster. Fields by 200 out of 2,000, so it basically it's a 10% booster. Okay. We also have rail guns. So which one is a rail gun and which one is? I honestly have no idea. Well, whatever it is, we're okay with it. There's definitely some. Uh, Some uh, room for change, but uh, there's a couple oopsies. Well, let's take the sept and uh, let's launch, shall we? We are moving.
but it looks good. Everything so far is very uh, relativistic. On the other hand, without much of a lead indicator, okay, there is a lead indicator. backwards yeah according to this I'm doing minus to find all the uh, controls then. Down left, right, QE, back quote, afterburner, target speed. We should just target speed. Those are there. So far, I pretty much completely lost, right? There is an autopilot. Uh. I'll go fly assist. Okay, U and X. Well, basically, this becomes a more of a jousting event. Uh, we try to go at each other. We accelerate to ridiculous speeds. And then we just keep going at each other until we hit something. I 
to kill me. It's kind of interesting. Or did I kill him? I think I killed him. Okay. Medium blaster is completely screwed up.
so I'm like jousting. I have no idea what the controls are anymore. Windmills and uh, let's just say windmill always gets by with zero. It really feels a lot like jousting, tell the truth. And uh, uh, you know, the uh, obviously the interface needs a little work, especially when you got the HUD against a dark background, so it needs to have some sort of auto contrast controls. And uh, right now, the even the simplest uh, maneuvers will get you out of the hits. Uh, of course, I was playing on very easy, so uh, something to think about, basically. On the other hand, it uh, the need for uh, some maneuvers to keep your turrets uh, in play. Uh, or rely on your speed to uh, and only put the strong guns on the front and back is, uh, so you make slashing attacks can make for an interesting uh, fighting style so uh, it certainly requires a bit more uh, thinking than just a straight uh, fighter combat so Something to keep an eye out, perhaps. Anyway, uh, thank you for taking a look at uh, A-Spec. Uh, and uh, the author did invite me to do this uh, playtest, but otherwise uh, it was uh, the game uh, demo slash play is free. And so far it's kind of interesting. And uh, I will see you in the next game that we try. Uh, it's, uh, so far, it's a little on the primitive side. I kind of wish we were going up uh, against more enemies. Like, uh, maybe will a fighter be able to overwhelm a ship like this? Or will it be going too fast or too slow? How about really big uh, cap ships? Uh, need to see more uh asymmetrical fights anyway thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one